video I will be showing you uh, how to add an image view within um, a row cell uh, within a UI table view in the iPhone iPad SDK. Uh, this is, I guess, part four of my UI table view series, tutorial series. Um, so go ahead and open up Xcode. I have a little icon here that I downloaded. It's just an Xcode ping file, which I, uh, by the way, make sure to put in the resources folder. Um, so there it is. It's going to be pretty simple. We're just going to have a single row within our table view and just put that image within its image view. So it's a, it's a navigation-based application. I already created it. And you can you can go ahead and do that there. I didn't really change anything. Um, so, we're going to say, you know what, let's just for testing sake, we're going to have, let's make it five rows. It's only the same row though, so cell that text label that text um, I set as X code string. Um, we already talked about the cell text label text. So now we're going to do cell dot uh, something called the image view dot image. So we're setting the image property of the image view property of the cell. That makes sense. So this is going to be of t this needs to be of type UI image, which we can allocate like we do anything any other variable or any other object. Um, and we're going to init with contents of file. Uh, in a string path, we can pass. Um, the NS bundle um, stuff here. Um, I don't know. If you've probably seen the NS bundle main bundle before, um, but anyway, it's it basically gets the string to the resources folder, and then you know, then we pass the the add-on string to our file that we're looking for. So we need to have NS bundle main bundle, and then a resource path. So that'll get the full string. Um, path to our resources folder, and then we need to do um, uh, resource. Uh, sorry, I always, I always, I always forget about um, path for resource. Gosh, I don't have a very good memory for resource. Actually, we don't need to have resource path in there. The path for resources, it, it add on, it adds on. You know that path for resource, um, and then let's say, uh, oh yeah, it's Xcode of type. Um, it's a PNG, so you just type in PNG. So we close those brackets, close those brackets, and once again, uh, you could get rid of the, the resource path part of this because uh, the path for resource. Um, method will also add on the resource uh, folder and then that reminds me I need to do a tutorial series about file um, the file system alright so let's go ahead and try that save build and run see if that works it should work I hope it works anyway <laughs> okay it's opening up the simulator and it's going to do it. There we go. So, you know, once again, it's a simple application, but it gives you an idea of how to add images to your uh, cell or your row cells um, uh, within the iPhone SDK. So, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, rate, comment on this video. Uh, check out my other videos and check out my blog and Twitter links in the description box. Thanks for watching.